Welcome, 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 Tanya's Tarot. This is a Divine Connection channel, my loves. And that's all we work with over here is Divine Connections. If you're interested in individual signs and just overall collective read, check out my Purple Priestess channel or my Everything Pisces channel, okay? The links are down below in the description box. We're going to jump into this read, see what we're talking about today. Uh-oh. Who in this divine connection are we talking about? What is the messages for our divine connection collective at this time? That was it. Thank you. to jump divine connections one two three one more is what i heard divine connections okay they gave us five we'll take them okay they gave us six okay so it's like this i heard like this so we're gonna do this okay so somebody wants to come towards you here they want you they want you to know they're different now okay um this person could be watching you if you post on social media, if you have a channel, um, it says they watch your channel, Snap, Tarot, videos, music, Facebook, TikTok, Insta, cooking, social media, Twitter. So if you're out here posting, um, they're watching. If you don't have Facebook or you're not posting, this message is not for you. This is for somebody that posts. Were you posting pictures? Are you putting content up? Somebody that you were dealing with, they want to come in and let you know they're different now. And they're pissed the F off because you walked away. Okay. So somebody you walked away from is watching your channel. They're watching what you're doing, okay? Um, I feel like you walked away because you learned your lesson. You said, thanks for the lessons, but I'm done with this and you. So, yeah, I feel like you walked away from somebody because you were done with the, the karmic lessons. or Yeah, I feel like it was karmic lessons that you learned from this connection here. And you, you walked away from this person. But this person, whoever it is you walked away from, they want you to know they're different now. Huh. They could have went towards a karmic and the karmic cheated on the DM. So now they, they, they want to come back towards you. They've learned their lesson. Huh. They learned their lesson with the karmic. They're done with the karmic because they got cheated on by the karmic. Yeah, it was a toxic temptation. For some of you guys, this could be the karmic, watching the divine masculine, watching the divine feminine, wanting to go back towards this divine masculine, telling this divine masculine that they're different now. Whatever they did was just a toxic temptation. They're mad because this divine masculine walked away. They're telling this divine masculine that they learned their lesson, but this, this divine masculine is done with them. It can also be read that way, guys, okay? I do feel like more so this is divine masculine coming back towards this divine femme. Because the karmic cheated on them. It was a toxic temptation. And now this divine masculine is upset because you walked away from them. So maybe they were playing with both of y'all and you walked away, right? And and they thought, well, I still got the karmic because you walked away. And this karmic ended up cheating on them. So they've been stalking and watching. Let's see. Divine connections. Let's see what's going on. Divine connections. Somebody feel comfortable with you here. Let me turn down just a little bit because I don't want them saying nothing about the music. Okay. Divine connections. Clarify I am different now. Yeah, so this person realizes that they're in love with you. Like I said, I feel like this is divine masculine coming towards you. Unconditional, certain, genuine love. So they realize that they're in love with you here. Clarify they watch your channel. Somebody been talking though. Petty, jealous, envious. So your divine masculine could have been a little petty, jealous, and envious of you as well. But I feel like this is the karmic and the divine master. I feel like they're both. Give me one more for watch your channel. Yeah, see? I feel like they're both obsessed. 
but it says ob obsessed must have indulgence. I feel like this karmic is obsessed with watching your channel, and I also feel like your person is obsessed with watching your channel. They may sit back and gossip, talk about it, talk about what they see, what they heard. I feel like the karmic is sitting back talking, they're gossiping, they're petty, they're jealous, they're envious. And I feel like the divine masculine is, a, is obsessing over you because they must have you. You're a must-have indulgence. Yeah, see, for this divine masculine, I know it's like a roller coaster, but you give them the highest of highs. It's an adrenaline rush when it comes to you, divine fam. Clarify pissed the F off because you walked away. Yeah, see, they were in denial. This divine masculine didn't think you were going to walk away, divine fam. They were not facing the truth, okay? They had irrational reasoning. But when you walked away, it opened their eyes and they're coming back to you. <laughs> they want reconciliation, spiritual union, soul contract. They want to come together. Clarify, thanks for the lesson. Yes, yeah, so you guys, you, you went quiet on them. They were in denial till you went quiet. And they learned this lesson. That you were done with them, done with this connection. You were not going to deal with them in a karmic. You will not continue to be a toxic temptation. Clarify, karmic cheated on the DM. Yeah, see, the karmic was trying to hold on to this divine masculine. Had their grips on your divine masculine here. Give me one more for karmic cheated. Yeah, so they could be fine out today. Something could be happening right now in the present, now in the moment. They could be fine out that this karmic was cheating on them. Trying to hold on to them to keep them from you. While you guys are in silence, this person may be reaching out, breaking this silence today. Because they are obsessed with you. Because they must have you. Hi, Drake. Clarify text toxic temptation. Somebody want to sit on it or spit on it. Clarify toxic temptation. Yeah, they finna pop up because they, 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 they can't get enough of you. Spontaneous, unexpected surprise visit. And it may be today. This person's coming towards you to take a gamble, take a risk. You may be in Vegas. Vegas may be significant. What happened in Vegas? Stay in Vegas. Okay? Person may reach out to you at nighttime. They might pop up at nighttime. See what that mouth do. Yeah, whoever this third party is, um, the drama queen, the karmic, they're thirsty. They're trying to cause chaos. They're upset because this person is walking away. Yeah, they. this karma could be somebody that they had a family with. This could be a family member. Somebody that have blood ties with somebody. Part of their inner circle. This could be a friend that was trying to hold on to them. But the truth is coming out today. Yeah, they're discarding whoever this karmic energy is. Throwing it out. Sit on it. This is falling. Am I supposed to use these? Because they fail. We're going to see. Divine connections. Get a nine inch. Somebody may want to put their nine inch in your face. Come on and crash into these waves. Somebody missing you sexually for sure. You may be missing this person sexually. Divine connections. Can I find this for you? Yeah, see, they want to come towards you and start over. They want forgiveness here, Divine Field. This Divine Masculine wants forgiveness. They want to start over. Yeah, that's Divine Connection. Yeah, I feel like in the past, they were not ready. They were not ready in the past. That's what They were in denial. They walked in, you walked away. Now they're ready. Yeah, this is your soulmate. They want to know, is this the end? They don't want it to be over. You could have ended this and walked away from this person. But they said they can see it, their self with you in the future. They're finna pop back up in your life. I ain't got much time left. So somebody may feel like you ain't got much time left. I give you my all and all you give me is your ass to kiss. Huh. 
What am I supposed to do with it? What are they supposed to do with it? I feel like this is you. You got somebody waiting on all the love you got to give. That's you, Divine Femme. You want to know when this Divine Master is going to live because you try to wait impatiently. But they want to come back. They were not ready in the past. Me like your L-O-V-E, you should tell me. Yeah, I feel like this is your energy. If they're not going to love you, they should tell you so you can move on. But I feel like this Divine Master wants to come in and tell you. They were in denial in the past because they had the karmic in you. They didn't think you were going to leave. They didn't think you were going to walk away. Now they realize that trust is crucial and they want to come in and rebuild this trust with you. The things from their past or your past are now released. They are releasing these third parties. Yeah, it's been a long time coming, but it's finally here, honeys. Divine connections. Yeah, they're going to come in and speak up, open up and speak their truth. Yeah, this could be a twin flame connection as well. So we got soulmate our twin flame. Your boy, acting like this shit don't phase your boy. That I made you boy. That I made you boy. You gonna love me. Cause I'm tired of waiting patiently. Okay, yeah, this person is really tired of waiting too. They want to love you. I feel like this is your energy though, Divine Film. This person is socially awkward right now. They're a little scared to come in and have this conversation. They could be healing from an STD, a sexually transmitted disease, or they could be healing from a spiritually transmitted disease. They could have been around somebody that has suffered this incubus, Jezebel energies attached to them. Okay? This person is lacking some confidence right now. But they want to come make this right with you. And they have released the things from their past. They're letting it go. Because they think you are awesome, babies. You are awesome. Is that it, his spirit, divine connections? They're going to send you a text, baby. They've been typing, and they've been erasing it. They type it, and then they erase it. Huh? Let's pull this deck, because I want to know, too. Okay, the karmic is still starting hate, her and her little crew. They're still in the background sending hate negative energy. Don't worry about them. God got them. I want to know. So if they've been typing messages and then erasing it, Let's see what they've been saying with the unsent message deck, okay? So let's see what the unsent message is. What is this divine masculine been typing to divine femme and then erasing it? What does divine masculine want to say that they're not saying besides the fact that it's unconditional love? For some of you guys, you can expect this message today. What is this divine masculine saying in his text messages but not sending? We do need it to jump. Divine, thank you. It says, I would travel for days to spend one minute with you. If there is distance, <clears throat> excuse me, if there's distance between you and your person, they would travel for days just to spend one minute with you. What else is this person typing and erasing? They love you like they ain't never loved somebody. Says, there's places I can't go anymore because of all the good memories I have there with you. Because you're awesome. They want to know, can you just talk? And then this is the title card, Unsent Messages. These are their unsent messages. They want to talk. You just let them. Bottom of the deck says, I wonder what life would be like today had we been able to compromise. They're ready to compromise now, baby. They may feel like you moved on to somebody else. But this is, I choose you, you chose someone else. So they want to come back towards you. You may be moved on to somebody else, you may not. They may feel like it's somebody else. That might be your energy. You may feel like you chose them and they chose somebody else. They chose the karmic. They may want to come talk to you about this. Yeah, because it's becoming exhausting not being with you here, honeys. Yeah, because it says letting go has been one of the most challenging things I've ever tried to do. They can't let you go. 
They don't want to let you go. Look, come, come on, why don't come home? They want to come back, babies. They want to come back. That's what they want to talk about. Look, and then it says, hello, you get my message? Tell you, they finna reach out. They finna reach out, honeys. And they're hoping that you reply when they do. Okay, babies? Now they want to give you things that you didn't even know you wanted. They don't want you to tell them that it's not enough, that you're over them. Because mm -mm, they're going to do anything, anything for you. Huh, if you just let them come through, spirit. Because you're awesome. They just want you to just let them. Just let them, babies. Okay? That is, um, I just heard somebody say, who is that singing that? That is, um, Sinead Harnett. Sinead Harnett? Sinead Harnett? Sorry, you guys, butchered. Butchered. I cannot talk. Butchered her name. Where am I doing? Throat chakra. People all up in my shit right now. Okay, baby, so I'm going to close this one out for you guys. If it resonates, let me know. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, my loves, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Bye, my TT babies.